Welcome to Coop's Nerf Buyer's Guide. This is a list of the top five blasters in a given category for potential buyers, you, to consider before your next Nerf purchase. This list is, at times, considering light modifications to the stock blasters. This is, after all, a Nerf modification channel. First category, primaries. The intended use of a primary is to be the main blaster used the, for the majority of your Nerf war. This is usually a standard blaster using normal ammo in order to share ammo more readily with your friends. Your primary generally has an average rate of fire, average accuracy, and average range without being too poor in any of these categories. So to the list, starting with number five. The Demolisher. The Demolisher is fun to use, has good performance, and a high rate of fire due to its flywheels. The Missile Launcher is also a really fun bonus. Number four, the Elite Rapid Strike. This is full auto, magazine fed power, which is very hard to compete with. It's only not number one because full auto comes with increased ammo consumption. Number three is the Nerf Long Shot. This has a very large air system allowing for great modification in a very comfortable shell. In unmodified form, however, this blaster wouldn't even make a top 10 list. So definitely do the basic mods and crank up the spring and it's a beast. Number two, the Elite Alpha Trooper. The Alpha Trooper is small, has great performance, and is very easy to use. When flywheels are too loud, an Elite Alpha Trooper is a great option. And number one, numero uno, the big winner, the Centurion. <laughs> what if somebody believed that? No, I'm kidding. The Centurion's total sh but seriously, number one, as many of you would guess, is the Nerf Strife. It's a small, efficient flywheel blaster that gives you great performance out of a very small package. If you want it to be bigger, you can add a stock or a barrel. It lands as number one in stock form, but for best performance, I would recommend taking out the mechanical locks and throwing in some upgraded batteries such as trust fires or IMRs. With basic modifications in the right ammo rig and plenty of ammo on your body, you will wreck everybody running a Strife. So there we have it, my top five primaries list for Nerf Wars. Keep in mind, this is my opinion based on my perception of what makes a Nerf Blaster battle effective. Do you disagree? Comment in the section below with your top five primaries. 